Hello and welcome to Open Boosters. Can we beat the $82 price point of Throne of Eldraine? I don't know. Maybe. It's possible. We shall see. This is just a normal booster box. It's not like the fancy collector's stuff and all that nonsense. Alright, $82. Do, do, do. How's everybody doing today? Hope you're having a great day. The sun is shining. It's January something or other, like the 10th of the night. Oh, I think, I think it's the 10th. Let's see, what day is today? <laughs> it is the 10th. I am right. Therefore, it is. Show me. All right, here we go. We did our other booster box. Well, it wasn't a booster box, it was a gift box or something like that. All right, here we go. We're gonna see if we can beat the price point here. Dun, dun, dun. Let's go to the meat. All right, starting out with a foil. There we go. Not a good foil, but you know, it's a foil nonetheless. I mean, it's a good card. Don't get me wrong, that's a good card because it's countered and that kind of stuff. Although sometimes I can't get the stuff where it's supposed to be in order to counterspell stuff. There you go. Got our contender here. That's a great card right there. It's quick. That one's not too bad, but you have to be playing knights, so. Ah, uh, poor knights. <laughs> do, 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 do. Might as well separate them. That's fine. There we go. There's one that's awesome. Go get the cards out of your sideboard. Ta -da, ta -da. Oops. <laughs> Witch's Oven has been very, very annoying on many levels. That's a great card right there. I found that very useful in black. Ah, not too bad. This one's this one I'm just starting to play with. Figuring it out. Well, not figuring it out, but finding it's a awesome usage, I should say. Let me fix this real fast. And comments there. The Fay of Wishes is really good. Eh, that one's there. All right, that one's great. Really good right there. That one's fantastic. Used that effectively. This one I've actually used effectively too. He might have been a great rare. I mean, I'm just saying. This one has killed a couple of my opponents, so that's that's good. I like that one too. Right. Did I just put you in the comment the comment section? Sorry about that. All right, we'll get organized here. <laughs> I haven't played with that yet. That I've played with, that's very useful. Um, if it was just, if it was one last, this thing would be like in everybody's deck. I'm just saying. <laughs> It'd be too powerful at that point. Do, do, do. Yep, I'm playing the crud out of that one. Everybody's playing the crud out of that one. I mean, you have a 4 3 and it does 2 damage. You can get it out. I mean, it's really good. That one's fantastic. I can't say anything wrong about that card. Except that it's red. No, I'm just it's appropriate to be red. Preferred in blue. But it wouldn't make any sense in blue, so. Anywho. That is actually an okay card. It's not fantastic, but it's, it's it, it works. It works. He's a mythic, but you know. It works, but it's not fantastic. That's just freaking annoying. Well, it's annoying because, you know, it's appropriate that it goes with this. <laughs> we got that and that, you know. Very appropriate, but no, not that. Sorry. 
the Lucky Clover. But, you know, it's just... That Lucky Clover makes the adventure thing just insane at that level. If that makes any sense. Works really well. Still insane. Alright, we got our foil knight here. And then we have our feasting troll king. I played him one time. That's it. So I only have one. <laughs> I found this clock servant pretty good. Eh, that was okay. The clockwork servant. Yep, there you go. Wait. Ah, I see, see, see. I gotta get used to that. See, we have fair wishes and fair wishes. Alts. Do, do, do. Alright. That one's freaking fantastic. Especially if you're doing the food thing. This dragon's actually not that bad, but if you don't have any cards in hand, <laughs> can go backwards pretty quick. As I did to myself. <laughs> in one game. <laughs> Oops. Alright, there's our next foil. Yeah. Great card there, if you can make yourself a draw deck. I managed to keep it. I actually started trading it because people put other stuff out there that's more damaging, so I'd give them that card. I'm using the exchange uh, sorcery. It's permanent. Go, love struck beast. Yeah, that one's not that great. It's just that one life thing. Piper. Room night. That one's that one's the nope, that's not it. Thought it was a different one. There's our foil, another foil. So far, none of the big foils. Yet. That one I've seen used against me really well because of that one extra damage each time. But I've also, you when they play it against me, I've actually overpowered them because it gave me so much draw. So, be careful with that one. <laughs> So I won and lost with that one. Planes. That's a fun card. That's a fun card. There's a lot of decks going around with that one. I got it to go off a couple times, but I, my, my, my deck version of that is just it's not as good as others. They have more cards of that. This just remove all the creatures from the board. I don't have enough cards yet. On Arena. So. Well, I don't have enough cards of this even here at the house. So. <laughs> There's probably five. Well, there we go. He'll be interesting in the future. I have a, I have a couple ideas for him. 
Get you that draw that you need. That's not as bad as the other one, the Lucky Clover. Them getting more cards in hand, yes, that's bad, but that Lucky Clover just, it's just a thing. <laughs> I, can, I can deal with the uh, Lucky Clover. I can't deal with the Lucky Clover as much as I can deal with the other guy. All right, we got our Fabled Passage, so that's good. That's a good one if you're playing with the food. Whoops, wrong pile. Alright, I have not seen very many people play with this, except for one person. So that's actually was cool. And he crushed me with it. So, there's that. However, you know, it is just with the big creature, you know, with mana producing abilities. So it wasn't that, you know, catastrophic. It was just I also had a bad draw. <laughs> and we got our giant foil skewer. Yummy. Oh, another feasting troll king, okay. It's two of those. Got our goose. Da -da -da. Oops, wrong pile. The goose. Not that that's an expensive card, I'm just saying that it's very useful for the food stuff. You need something to eat, there it is. You can eat the goose at the end. And be happily ever after. I'm just saying, it's a fun thing. That's a great card. Those two right there. Well, he can get out with life, but if you want to keep going. Deathless Net. We got our foil champion here. Not quite the rare that I was going with for my foil rare. Hopefully there'll be another one. Here's our next, next Mythic. That's actually a very good, useful card, especially with that part right there. Destroys all giants. That's good. It's fantastic. That one's like, nice. I like that one. Great removal if you're playing with light. So, clear the board. That's the major objective. I'm behind. Clear the board. There's our foil goose. That's a lot better than the other one. <laughs> Yay, foil goose! <laughs> oh, I should put that up there. Yeah. Because they're, they're foiled out. Alright, that's two. Well, at least three. That's a great card. Can't say that's not. Da -da -da -da. I have used it quite a bit. I only get to draw with the tapping up after the day so you can get through. That's a good card if you can get the draw to go with it and someone doesn't blow it off the board. <laughs> I can never keep it on board long enough to even do anything. Fantastic card there. Obviously good. I don't know the prices of the cards, so I don't even know for a head, behind, in the middle. I don't know anything. It's crazy. Terrible, right? I should be up on all this stuff. Do, 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 do. There we go. We're mythic. And that's a good one, the Royal Science. I like it. It's fantastic. Give us that draw. Just notice I'm going to have to delete something off the camera. I'm hoping to get through this a little faster now. 
There's that. Because we're running out of time. Four minutes of this on the clock. I might pause it. It's all right. Oh, good. All right, cool. We got Gurk. There we are. That's a great card, by the way. That one's awesome. It's got to be at least pricey a little bit. I would assume. Can't see that being cheap. I have not played with that, but it exists in my hands now. <laughs> Does anyone, anyone know if that's good or not? Now there's our troll. He's fun to put out there. That's a good one right there, the gargoyle. Ah, the talisman. People have been using that very effectively and then sending it back to their hand. So that's actually good. I only have one and I never even get it in my hand. So I try to put it in there <laughs> just so I could play it, but. I need another one. I need at least two, I guess. To really see what it does. There's the Love Struck Beast, who I have nothing of in Arena. <sighs> so sad. <laughs> need more cards. Alright, we got a Worthy Knight. Very worthy. He works well. There's the bane of everybody's existence, this dang cat. <laughs> they banned that. The decks in standard would change dramatically. <laughs> uh, let's see, there's the dragon I never see anybody playing. No one's playing that night lane unless they have knights. And then we have Castle. Everyone's playing with that, and that's a good card. Fantastic to get more draw in your hands. One minute left, and I got to the last one. Right, good. That way, when I stop the TCG player, I'll do the TCG player, but I'll go ahead and uh, go ahead. And there's our our uh, extra night guy who is Flash. Da -da -da -da. All right, cool. I'll do the TCG player app, delete, and make some space. Didn't have to pause it during the video. That's good. All right, I'll be right back, guys. All right, so we did good. We got $100.55 worth of cards out of an $82 box. Sounds good. All right, hit the like button, subscribe, make a comment, and I'll catch you on the next one. All right, talk to you again real soon.